All right, and good evening. Thanks once again for joining in on Heaven's Handyman Contractor Channel. This is the after video for the job I talked to you earlier about this morning when I was doing a four inch waistline down in the basement and also repositioning a toilet um, when this bathroom gets finished. Let me show you what I have and talk you through it, okay? Uh, here on this first floor bathroom, I've taken a toilet from here and repositioned it over here because they're going to be modifying and refinishing out the bathroom again. Um, also, I've re redirected the hot and cold water lines, as you can see here, along with the, um, the inch and a half PVC pipe for the, uh, what's called the trap, sorry, for trap for the sink, uh, to be connected later, later on. And I've also prepped the floor a little bit with a piece of uh, Wonder Board um, for the toilet. Let me just take you downstairs real quick and show you what's downstairs. As I told you earlier, uh, I had to reposition um, a four inch pipe. I had to cut the existing pipe and then run it an additional length. So here's what we have. This was the four inch pipe in question that I've connected with a no-hub coupling along with a support strap and it actually runs about nine and a half, close to ten feet. Here's another, uh, another support strap here and then I have it glued up and going up to the toilet. Um, this is the water line. I used an ex existing piece of, of copper pipe that they had from the last time, but it has a new shutoff valve up at the top. So this is a piece of copper pipe, and what I did was I shark bited into a piece of PEX, nice and quick, over here, which is code compliant for Nassau County, Long Island, into half inch copper over here. They also, I also had to do their inch and a half um, waistline here, so I put a, a hub coupling here with a piece of inch and a half PVC pipe into a trap with a clean out straight up uh, into the ceiling for the sink as well running the hot and cold line again with shark bites onto the existing half inch piping bringing it up here and directing it sorry and directing it up to the ceiling for their hot and cold water um, in addition to that and finally they, they needed two replacement shutoff valves because the shutoff valves here and here were oxidized and they were dripping. So I got them ball valve joints that actually are shark bites and connected that up along with a half inch shark bite coupling and both of them are connected identically uh, to one another, same, same, same process. So that's the job and it's, let me see here, it's, uh, it's almost 8 o'clock in the evening. I started at about Ooh, about 10 30 this morning and I'm just getting it done I had to run back to Home Depot in the process so that took a little bit of time so there you have it uh, thank you once again for joining in I hope to see you the next time on Heaven's Handyman Contractor channel until then HHC out